slowly but surely my endurance was starting to lack. Um, I wasn't able to do the things that I used to be able to do and I could definitely tell it wasn't just a question of age. Mike is my amazing husband. We've gone through so much together. He has the strength of a titanium man because he is and I love that about him. My patient Mike is a very special man. He is incredibly engaging, incredibly energetic. But when I first met him, he was unable to do what he wanted to do. He had bad arthritis in his hips and in his knees. You get used to something that goes slowly over time. And slowly but surely, it started to worsen and worsen. My ability to climb stairs or, or to climb ladders. He loved life. He wanted to be active. He loves his wife, Debbie, and together, they ran a small business and were always trying to be active. But as years went by, Mike's arthritis has gotten bad enough where both his hips were affected, both his knees were affected. I couldn't sleep through the night in bed. I had to go out of the living room and sit in a chair. And that's when we decided this has gone too far. It's time to take this next step. He wanted to be more engaged. He wanted to be more social. He wanted to wear his Hawaiian shirts and go dancing and have a good time, but he couldn't. It is an amazing situation when you have a doctor that cares so much. Not only do I consider Dr. Shaw my physician, I consider him my friend. The kind of doctor he is not only worries about his patient, but he worries about the wife, the husband, the family. I grew up my entire life since a very young age exposed to medicine. My parents are incredible humanitarians. I'm a son of two physicians. They spend a lot of their life traveling from the city of Mumbai to tribal villages and taking care of people. And I had the good fortune to go with them and develop the love and passion about taking care of people. That was when I decided that this is what I wanted to do. I wanted to take care of people. The first surgery I did for Mike was to replace his hip. Replacing his hip allowed him to start walking. He was losing weight, he was trying to be active. Mike loves wearing his Hawaiian shirts and he was wearing a lot of Hawaiian shirts at that point. He was out, he was having a good time. Dr. Shaw replaced both of my hips and both of my knees. Mike and I can go outside and walk. We can do festivals again. Debbie and I are able to enjoy life so much more now. We can walk through a grocery store without having him have to sit down. Time to time we've talked and he says, you know what, Deb, I can't believe I am not in the pain that I was before. Basically, Debbie and I now are looking forward to doing more in life. Uh, we're hoping to be able to go on our vacations again now. We're going to the health club. We're getting ourselves back into shape. We're, and we're going to start dancing again. An incredible turn of events where he's enjoying his life even more. He is active. He is engaged with his wife. And that beautiful relationship that they shared has been taken to another level. There is no more pain. And with that, there's happiness. We are both very thankful. And we know that the upcoming months and years will be amazing. And we're looking forward to the next 10, 20, uh, whatever years that we are allowed to have to be able to enjoy life just that much more. For people suffering like my patient Mike, who have bad arthritis, whose level of activity has gone down year after year, who are frustrated because they have limitations. Doing orthopedic surgery, doing joint replacement surgery, allows me to take their problem, execute my plan, and allow them to get back to a quality of life that they find acceptable.